This is Dabu7. We've been talking about the thinned out shelves, how inflation is going through the roof and the cost of everything has risen extremely. Well, now that this war in Ukraine is kicked up, it's having a ripple effect throughout many of the other areas, food being one of them big time. And the sanctions that were put on Russia, they countered by saying, we're going to stop putting out fertilizer and all these other critical goods, critical grain, wheat that is supplied around the world. They're going to stop. Other countries have already seen this and said, guess what? If they're not going to put out the fertilizer that we need, we're done shipping any of our stuff. This is causing things to lock up quickly. You won't see this probably until the next couple of weeks as all those shipments that are already in route get to the shelves, get filled, and then all those orders coming in behind that are not going to be. It's just going to be more stagnant because they're not coming in. We have full-blown countries saying they're not shipping out things like wheat and grain at all. Zero at this point because of this. You'd be crazy to think that this, this is not going to have an effect on all of us. Because some people keep walking to the grocery store, everything looks fine. Well, here at some point, it's going to affect everybody big time. And it's not just food. Energy prices as well going through the roof. And they're saying that all this is going to continue. And it's so bad, they fear that it's about to spark the next Arab Spring. When it comes to the breadbasket to the world, Russia and Ukraine together account for a quarter of the global grain trade. A quarter of global. And you got to think of what's been GMO'd in there as well here at this point. So all this talk about bracing for rationing is all over the place. Many warning signs out there again and again and again about what's coming. So I just want to let folks know we talk about this in greater detail on the live shows. Going live Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern. Going to be focused a whole lot more on the survival aspect of this. And as we get into spring, people need to be growing. They need to be getting their own food up and going ASAP and preparing for the next next year. Back to back to back from here. Preparing, preparing and depending on no one else but yourself. Because when these grocery stores are completely shut down or don't have things, it's all about the barter system that you put together with your friends, your family, your neighbors, your community. Okay? So that's the key this year is building on that. We talk about that and a whole lot more on the live streams. Hope to see you there. Links below. Hit that subscribe button for more. Much love, y'all.